Giants coming in. What are you watching? What are some things you're watching for uh, Browns Giants Sunday? This is the perfect game for us to really take that step. Like we took a couple baby steps, you know, this past week. Our defense looked good. Our uh, like a Deshaun Watson looked like he took a step forward. Um, but you got a pretty, I don't want to say a pretty good, you have a very, very, very good matchup for you to where not only can you maybe test some things out, but you can really have an opportunity to open up this offense and let Deshaun Watson maybe see how that shoulder is really feeling, who he can really start to trust in certain throws in certain areas. I'd love to see Amari Cooper finally catch a couple passes that are wide open. I'm not worried about two at all. I do think there's a little bit of something there to, so, you know, to look at, but other than about being worried about it, I'm not so worried about it. Um, the offensive line, what, what's going to happen with this thing? Is Jack and Jed, is Jack and Jed finally going to play? And is Jed going to be serviceable at it? Like, there's so many questions with this offensive line, and we kind of need to figure that out before that big stretch of football is coming up after this easy stretch. So um, this is definitely a fine-tuned game, I should say. And we should be able to come out here and look like what we expect them to look like, not what we hope. We should have high expectations for this game. Go out there and get it done. The, the one thing is can't come out flat. Uh, the, the, you cannot – do not take this – you know, get on top of this team and, and bury them quickly. Exactly. And put your foot on the gas. Like, I'd love to see 35, 40 points put up. That means that, number one, your offense was being aggressive – until your defense was being relentless and getting you turnovers and getting the ball back on third and outs and stuff like that. So the, I, one thing that Kevin Stefanski is known to do, he'll get a little bit of a cushion in that third, fourth quarter. And next thing you know, we're three and out, three and out. And now the defense or the defense is tired and their offense is moving. And we're sitting here playing this panic game. Don't do that. Let's take control of the game and let's put them in the dirt. Yeah. And I'm with you. The other thing that we didn't say about Sean Watson didn't turn the ball over. That was a huge thing in Jacksonville. Again, keep that ball out of the hands of the Giants.